what you're seeing right now in the background is gameplay of the Divari Paradox. To be more precise, it's random gameplay that I just happen to have lying around that I decided to put on screen for you guys. And from time to time, you guys will see glimpses of me playing various card games, such as Marvel Snap. These are, of course, digital card games because they coincide with what this video is about, which is this video is basically one big advertisement for my other YouTube channel, Card Kage, or Card Cage, as some people tend to call it. What is it? It's a card game focused channel. I, uh, I started with some Slater Spire, I did some Magic the Gathering Arena. I've been real focused on Marvel Snap lately because I am a fan of that game, okay? I'm low-key addicted to that game. So, when I'm not playing Warframe these days, I'm playing that game. The best thing of all, they have a PC version, but it is mobile inherently, meaning that when you're using the restroom or when you're out and about waiting for a uh, appointment or something, or say you have like five minutes to kill, you can just queue up a match. It's that simple. And of course, it's Marvel character-based. Now, there apparently is a DC version of Marvel Snap in the works by a different publisher and whatnot, I think. But, I believe I'm going to be covering that too, or at least checking it out, because that's the beauty of this new YouTube channel. It is... A card game channel. It's not just a one game channel. So I can play tons of different card games and whatnot. Now, I am hoping to low key get to a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. So far, it's not going great, honestly. I'm going to keep advertising it as I can every chance I get though, and hopefully it will work out. I'm really hoping it does, because that's my goal for this year, to get Card Kage to a thousand subscribers. No, it's not a Warframe related channel, but if Warframe does ever come out with a card game, you better bet I'll cover it on that channel. Oh yeah.